The High School Learning Program is based in sustainability, entrenched in sustainability in everything that we do. It also brings together teachers and students to be able to work on local problems as well as global ones. Students have a real ability here to craft and shape the direction of the projects in class, but as well as their learning experience. And so this makes it that we're able to really tap into their interests, their skills, and their areas of growth in order to contribute towards a community of learners making our world sustainable. Math, humanities, social studies, science, but also enterprise and environmental studies. So all of these things happen in a way to get the credits. This makes it that we have groups of students who are able to really dig into what interests them as well as meet the rigorous academic requirements. So here we have an example, Brooke, who is wonderfully able to show exactly what it means to be able to work within our academic rigor, our requirements, as well as create his own path. Brooke has done so much inside the classroom and outside to contribute to the community and his own learning. I really hope you'll enjoy this video. Good morning, I'm Brooke, and this is the day in the life of a grade 11 student at Green School. Right now, I'm at the gate, and I'm ready to start my classes. First up, we have advisory, where I get to meet with my advisors, and they get to check up with how I'm doing. Right now, I'm in Ibra Hayes class, which is called FizzBiz, where we're looking at the process of fermentation on food. So that's class done. Yeah. Now I've got break. The great thing is we've actually got a coffee shop on campus. So let's go get a coffee. So right now I'm in Bahas class where we are learning about different jobs. We're learning about how to describe people's jobs and what they do. A fun activity we're doing at the moment is that it gives us a description of the job and we have to kind of guess what the job is, all in Bahasa, Indonesia. I just finished my class in Bahasa. Now I'm off to Pak George for a documentary class where I'll be asking critical questions for my interview. Now it's time for lunch. <laughs> Thank you, Ibu. Just about to go to meet with Jonathan, my mentor. The project I'm working on with him is called The Living Bridge, where we're trying to rebuild the bridge at Green School. It's such a sort of, it's been a real privilege um, to be Brooks' mentor. And it is really beautiful to watch, uh, to see a young, 16 year old be able to be creatively tackling and solving issues which normally you'll be doing at a graduate university level and, and he's already doing that now. I'm really proud of Brooke's development as a creative. Seeing Brooke not just only interact in a team but also become a leader within his own segment, collating all of the classes' designs into this one master film animation product. And I think these skills will serve him well when he is uh, within the working world, you know, or in other social situations outside the campus. For the final part of my day, I've got Greenstone with Buhari, where we are preparing for next year where we're going to do our Greenstone presentations. Thank you for tuning in to hear about my day. And we hope to see you guys again soon.